it's an old-timey radio. Charming. And welcome back, listeners, throughout Transylvania and indeed the whole of Romania. That was, um, let me see here. Hm. Oh, well, apparently I have no idea who was singing that, but, uh, oh boy, what a stinker. Maybe we're better off not ever knowing, right? Right, well, never mind that. You know that's the exception right here on Garlic Radio, because we only play the top Transylvanian hits. Uh, uh, uh. It's your boy, wait, no, it's your main man, Yanku, and we'll be spending the next hour or so together, so buckle up, everybody! Uh, no, seriously, whether you are in an autonomous or animal traction vehicle, wear the seatbelts. Please, they don't put those potholes in the road for nothing, you know what I'm saying? Ah, 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 ah. Ooh, I crack myself up sometimes. Anyway, dear listeners, Here's a weather update. We have no idea what's happening anymore. Darn it, weather. What is this, some kind of a joke? And what's this hurricane, Herbie, or whatever they call it, doing here? Hurricanes? In my Transylvania? And not only that, apparently it's messing with the GPS and internet in certain areas. I'm told the Forum Maris is affected by this. Well, Forum Marisians, I hope you're receiving this. You should at least have a garlic radio in your life, am I right? Sure, I'm right. Alrighty, where were we? Go I think they're the owners of this fine establishment. Hi! Hello, foreigner! Greetings, stranger! My name's Kerwin, Buzz Kerwin. Rodika. And this is my husband, Istvan. Wait, did you say Kerwin? Yes, I'm actually half Romanian myself. Tu lai domne, Isti, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, dear, and I don't like it one bit. What? Nothing! Never mind. Oh, why does everything have to be so mysterious and complicated? What was that about my name? Oh, it's just... Uh, how do you spell that? K-E-R-W-A-N See? That doesn't sound like a local name. Not at all! Has it been altered in the last few generations? You know, I really have no idea. Wait, altered from what? Istvan, let it go. It's the gentleman's business. But Cor... Shush! Cor what? Enjoy your stay in scenic Transylvania, my friend. I'm looking for a girl. This is not that kind of in. No, no, a particular girl. Her name is Peace. Is this some kind of uh, social commentary metaphor you're trying to pull? Pretty beautiful if it is. Uh, no, I mean it in the most literal way. Look, we have to be very skeptical to strangers around here. Especially foreigners. Don't ask, we just do. Foreigner, stranger... No one ever seems to be welcoming anymore. I'm starting to think it's me. Oh, it's uh, not you. We have to... Istvan, you should stop talking now. Now I'm even more curious. Curiosity is a very healthy thing. Up to a certain point. Then it can start to become extremely unhealthy. I love when you put complicated things into concise sentences. Even simple people can understand, Rodi. Oh, stop it, you charmer. I'm still curious about your unwelcoming attitude. I mean, this is an inn, right? We are, um, we have to be skeptical toward foreigners. Have to? And I'm half Transylvanian. Half Transylvanian, huh? 
Okay, okay. Let's say you need to earn our trust. Here then. How would one go about earning your trust then? Suika! Gesundheit. You said you're half Transylvanian. Suika is our local drink. 60% alcohol. 60? And you expect me to ingest that? I can't trust a man unless he drinks with me. What century is this again? It's our tradition. So, we drink? Hit me. Norok! There you go! Now, ask me anything! I don't understand! Come back when you're sober, eh? <laughs> Hit me! Norok! There you go! Now, ask me anything! I don't understand! Come back when you're sober, eh? <laughs> Talk to you guys later! Servus! A quite voluminous guy unlit pipe in his mouth. Hey, 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 hey. Greetings, my skinny friend. Oh my, hey, hey there. Good to meet someone friendly. <laughs> Have you been talking to these grams around here? Uh, don't judge them too harshly. That's standard foreigner procedure. Standard procedure? This must be a cultural barrier thing, I'm baffled. I am afraid it's not for me to explain. So, let's just leave it at that. So, what is it you wanted to talk to me about, Sonny? Have you seen a foreign girl around here? Goes by the name of Peace. I uh, don't have that kind of information, friend. That's something you should ask of Istvan and Rodika, the innkeepers. Why is everyone, except for you, so unfriendly? I uh, don't have that kind of information, friend. My name's Buzz, Buzz Kerwin. Luca, the coachman, at your service. How's the coach business going, Luca? It really depends on where you want to go. It's been several days now that we have no GPS signal. Strange times indeed. You need GPS for your coach? Well, again, it depends on where you want to go. Some places are very difficult to access even to an experimented couchman like me. So, me and Rosie have to relay on technology. You know? But everything is so traditional around here. Ah, uh, don't let appearances fool you. We have some of the fastest internet in the world, friend. It just sort of went away locally, along with the GPS signal. Just went away? You didn't look into it? Everyone who was good at computers moved away years ago, sadly. Tech support should be on its way. Unfortunately, with no GPS and the treacherous terrain, plus this weather, who knows when they'll arrive. Oh, that really sucks. So I'm not getting any GSM service either. I am afraid not. Oh heavens, how I miss my 4G.
What if I told you I'm tech support? Well, uh, you'd make Luca a very happy man. See, my love life. <sighs> yes? <sighs> Why am I about to pour my heart out to a stranger? Because I'm incredibly well versed in matters of the heart. Oh, look, my friend. See that beautiful waitress over there. Her name's Anna. The prettiest name in the world. Just listen to it. Anna. Anna. Luca is so in love with her. Uh, sorry, but what does this have to do with the GPS and internet being down? Well, this isn't the Middle Ages, Buzz. I can't just walk up and talk to her like some troglodyte. You can't? <laughs> no, no, no. Of course not. Not in this digital day and age. Oh, I can't rest until I see which way she swipes for me on garlic. Is that some kind of a dating app? The best there is in Transylvania. What if she's just not into you? Oh, Luca will just look for another girl. I guess. But I need to know first. Can't make any moves before that. Huh, that's a very mature way to see things. Nice. Eh, <sighs> life is too short to cry over spilled milk, friend. <laughs> Plenty of pretty girls in Transylvania. Don't you worry about that. I just hope she doesn't fall for that hipster Vasile. With his trimmed beard and his fancy haircut. Huh? What if I go ask her for you? What is this? Fort grained in the 18th century? Huh. I'd be left out of the inn. <sighs> what are you eating there, Luca? Oh, just had my mamaliga. But I'm afraid it's all gone. Do you think I could have the little cauldron? I'll bring it back. Well, uh, sure. As long as Rodica doesn't notice, help yourself. Luca, help me out with this Tsuika thing. No, 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 thank you. Got to keep a clear head when steering the couch. <laughs> I meant, do you have any idea what I can do so it doesn't hit me like a freight train? Um, I remember reading about that on a forum recently. But my memory isn't what it used to be. If only the internet was working! See you later, Luca. Talk to you soon, Buzz.
It's a tourist info thing about the statue in town in general. Yep, just as I suspected, it's a Vlad. Okay, this should stop it from burning my fingertips. Wait, what do you think you're doing? What? I'm... I need this bulb. My folks are from around these parts. Oh, sure. Silly me. Why don't you grab the statue while you're at it? Hey, I'll, I'll bring it back, okay? I, I need this. For such a goody two-shoes, you sure do borrow things a lot. Shut up, cat. Not with my light bulb. Watch out! What? What? Y you just said watch out. I did? Oh, I did. What? Oh, watch out! That there is not vinegar! It's not? What? No, it's a powerful solvent. I, uh, uh, I mislabeled it. <laughs> Silly me. Nearly killed myself with it. Not to mention me. Can I still have it? What? Yes, yes, take it. Just don't put it in your salad. What? What? Oh, darn it, now I'm doing it too. Uh, thanks. It's a fork with very bent tines. I mean, who knows? It might come in handy. <laughs> 